What's up, everybody? Disciple D. Yep. I want to come on here with a word today from the Lord. I want to come on here. Uh, so before we get started, I'm going to start off with prayer. Heavenly Father, we come to you, Heavenly Father, tonight, Heavenly Father, just thanking you, Lord God, giving you praise, Heavenly Father. Lord God, for who you are, Heavenly Father, we give you praise. We give you thanks. We give you glory, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Heavenly Father. Lord God, as I, as I read your word and give out your word tonight, Heavenly Father, I ask, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, that the ears that need to hear it, Heavenly Father, will hear it, Heavenly Father. That the hearts, Heavenly Father, that they need to touch, Heavenly Father, it will touch them, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Heavenly Father. That any person that is going through this situation that you want me to speak on, that you want me to talk on, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Heavenly Father, let them hear it, Heavenly Father. Let them hear it, Heavenly Father. Let this video find them, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Heavenly Father. Lord God, let me disappear so you can appear. Lord God, let me not speak so you can speak, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Heavenly Father. Let my voice leave so you can speak, Heavenly Father. Let them not see me but you, Heavenly Father. Let them not hear me but you, Heavenly Father, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I'm coming from, I'm going to read from Isaiah chapter 41, verse 10. Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. Yes, I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. I just want to thank God for that word. Basically, everybody's going through a situation. Finances. You're going through marriage problems. You're struggling. You feel like a failure, anything. I just want you to know, like, as long as you lean on God, as long as you trust God, you trust in God, as long as you fear nothing but just trust in God, that his right hand will always lift you up, that his righteous hand, his victorious hand will lift you up. It will bring you through that situation. That victorious hand, his righteous hand will always bring you through that financial crisis you're going through, will always bring, through, bring you through that marriage problem you're going through, will always bring you, it will bring you through anything that you're going through, anything, anything. And I just want everybody to trust in the Lord, have faith in Jesus Christ. That's the only person the only person that can bring you through. That's the only person that can bring you through your situation. Nothing else can bring you through your situation. Only Jesus Christ. Only Jesus Christ. And so I just come on here today telling that we need to look, 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 and seek the Lord. We need to look and seek the face of the Lord. That's what we need to do. We need to look and seek the face of the Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Everybody is going through a situation. I'm going through a situation as we speak. But my faith and trust is in Jesus Christ. I know that his right hand will hold me up. I know that he won't leave or forsake me. So I just come on here today, give me y'all a word. Give me y'all encouragement words. You feel me? That Jesus Christ is the way. That Jesus Christ, no matter what, as long as you fear not, as long as you hold on to him, as long as you put your strength and your help in, and, and your faith in him, he's going to come through. He will always come through with his victorious right hand. He will come through that the hand of God will be stretched down, that the hand of God will be stretched down into your situation and he will pull you out. He will pull you out. You will see miracles. You will see signs and wonders. You will see signs and wonders. And you will know that God is in your life. You would know that God had been on you this whole time. Y'all need to just look back on your life now. Sometimes you just need to look back, reminisce, reminisce. To that situation where you didn't even think that you would come out of. That you didn't even think you would make it through. How you make it through. It was nothing but the hand of God that pulled you out. It was nothing but God, grace and mercy that, that pulled you out. So I just tell everybody right now. Fear not, for the Lord is with you. Be not dismayed. For he is your God. He will strengthen you. And he will help you. And he will uphold you with his righteous, victorious hand. In Jesus' mighty name. Thank y'all. Disciple D. Time flies, time flies, time flies.